Hey guys, good morning. So I am about to do my makeup. I have like literally 15, 20 minutes. I shouldn't even be filming right now, but I wanted to vlog because I'm gonna get my hair done. And it is long overdue. I think the last time I got my hair done was like in the springtime. And I'm just kind of over the highlights. I'll show you what my hair looks like right now. I really should not be vlogging. I know like on TikTok, everybody says like, oh, I have 15 minutes to get ready. And why are you filming a get ready with me? But I really did want to vlog. I just went to bed late. So I could not get out of bed as early as I wanted to today. I should have been got ready but anyways this is my hair right now it has gotten pretty long and i did like the highlights i'm not crazy about the front pieces because they are kind of like brassy but i'm just kind of like over it i was looking at some old pictures and i was like yeah i feel like i look the best with my dark hair and it's crazy because every time i have dark hair i'm like okay i need to change it's so annoying because i feel like no matter what i do i always end up going back to black hair but then I always get like sick of it after a couple months but I love my dark hair especially when it's short and it's fresh like I'm so excited so I'm gonna do just like something super simple I might not even wear false lashes today but I just like to do a little something when I get my hair done because then when the hair is all done it just makes everything like look better I should have got up like around 7 and I didn't get out of bed till like 7 40 so I feel like that kind of like backed me up a little bit my appointment's at 10 it's like 9 right now I do have like what I'm gonna wear picked out, just like jeans and a bodysuit. So when I'm done this, I'm just gonna get dressed and bounce. I hate being late also. That's like something I'm trying to work on. I don't like not being on time, especially for like appointments. It like drives me crazy. Just I feel like makes you look so bad. Dominique Cosmetics Wide Awake Full Coverage Concealer. Literally need this right now. I got like five hours of sleep. This feels so good. I love this metal applicator. I just need to look a little like alive when I get my hair done. It's like that one meme that's like you really are or you feel like the ugliest when you're sitting in the salon chair and like that is so true. I'm gonna use the Danessa Myrick's Yummy Skin Foundation Balm. I really have been enjoying this. You pretty much, the color is too dark for me though, but it's like literally a blurring balm. It gives you a little bit of coverage, but like it also smooths out your skin. I'm in the color four. I need to get the shade probably three, but I usually just make it work with like my other powders and everything. All right, I'm gonna use a little face and body bronzer from Soul Body. I was using the color light medium. This one is medium, but it's definitely more like reddish orange. I love this product though. I wish it was a little bit more like brown instead of like this like reddish undertone, but it blends so easily into the skin. Oh wait, I actually like that. It's very warm. I'm gonna do a little blush. This one is the Kaja Cheek Stamp Blush. So freaking cute. The packaging is bulky, but like this is adorable. You like take the little thing and then you get a little cheek stamp. I love it. it blends really easily. My makeup's probably also gonna get messed up because like of the hair dye and everything, but whatever. And I think that's it for the face. I'm just gonna set everything. I'm gonna do a little Charlotte Silberry powder on my under eyes. And for the face, I'm gonna use the Kosas Feathery Cloud Set Powder. A Rare Beauty lip pencil in the shade Worthy. And then I'm gonna do just a little bit of her lipstick. This one is in Worthy. Oh, is it the same color? A little gloss. AF94 in the shade Honey, I'm Home. Powder blush, cannot forget. Juvia's Place, volume four blush. I'm gonna use this bubblegum pink. I think my alarm's going off. I literally set an alarm to like leave because I don't wanna be late. ColourPop Act Natural Mascara. This get ready with me is pretty chaotic, but at least I have a little glam on. I love that blush. It like just, I feel like brings life to the face. I'm obsessed. Really simple OOTD. I love these jeans from American Eagle. I will link them for you guys if I can find them. I forget the name actually. I think they might be, oh yeah, they're here on this side. Real good jeans, is that what they're called? Oh no, clearly I need more sleep. Mom straight jean, that's what these are called. I love them, they're so comfortable. So I'm gonna wear these. My favorite bodysuit from Amazon. So stretchy and soft. The brand is Mango Pop. I will link these down below. They're on my storefront and they are the best. I have these in a couple different colors. And then I'm just gonna wear these little shoes that I got from Target. Okay, this is the Simple OOTD. Bag is from TJ Maxx. I cannot believe I got ready so fast, but I'll see you guys there.
is now, what time is it? It's like almost seven. And I came to TJ Maxx because it's my day off today. Because whenever I go and get my hair done, I feel like that's like my entire day. And by the way, I freaking love it. Like it's so soft and shiny. Like this is me, the black hair, the short hair. Like it's me. I love it. I feel like myself and I'm so excited to like put a cute outfit on, do my makeup. So if you guys are in the area, definitely check out Jackie. I will have her studio information down below. I came to TJ Maxx because what else do you do on your day off? You go to TJ Maxx, right? But I always love coming here just to like de-stress and like distract my mind for a little bit. I also feel like I haven't been here in like a minute and I want to see like just what's new. Not that I need anything. I honestly don't even plan on buying anything. I just want to go and like maybe window shop and just browse. Okay, they have the cutest little Halloween costumes for dogs. Like. These are adorable. I put Bernard in Halloween costumes like one year and he hated it. He does not like it. Oh wow, they have kiss lashes here. These look so pretty. I like these. There's also some Sephora collection lashes here. Oh my gosh, they have a Smashbox brush here. $16.99. Spotted some bare minerals. This is the original loose mineral foundation. How much is this? $10. Wow. Oh my god, you guys. I cannot believe they have Jaclyn Cosmetics here. $8. I'm pretty sure this is from like one of her limited edition collections. Honestly though, compared to like other times, it's pretty empty here. Like there aren't like that many things. Also found this Too Faced 3-in-1 spray. This I definitely tried before. $14.99. Okay, did anyone used to use Proactive like years ago? Because I used to use Proactive in high school and this brings back so many memories. Oh my God. There's a lot of really cute boots here. Mm -hmm. like I yeah, that's not mine. Yeah, <laughs> you're welcome. This lady was so sweet. She was asking if she could take uh, the shopping cart, but it wasn't even mine. But yeah, these boots are so cute. I love this one. I just don't really like the heel color, but like I like the actual boot itself. Does anybody else do this? Put it all the way here and then you browse. I'm like not feeling anything today, but I still like looking at everything. <laughs> So that was actually a very successful window shopping trip. I didn't buy anything, which is not always a bad thing. Anyways, I'm gonna go home, shower, and watch Power because me and Hector have been re-watching. It's like one of our favorite shows and we watched it like four years ago. We watched like the entire five or six seasons, however many seasons there were. And we just decided recently to like re-watch it and kind of deep dive and look for clues because if you guys will ever watch Power, it's a very intricate show. There's so much that goes into it. So we just decided to rewatch and that's kind of been like our thing in the evenings. And we didn't watch it last night because I was uh, up late like working on stuff. So I'm excited to watch tonight and relax. I got a shower, did my skincare, put my favorite pajamas on. These are from Target and they are literally the softest pajamas you will ever put on your body. I love them. I always rave about them. But yeah, I just did my skincare. I'm going to show you guys what I used tonight. So I've been trying out skin cycling. I literally just started like earlier this week. And basically I got the idea from TikTok, by the way, which everything that I reference nowadays is from TikTok. I swear it's like taking over. It's crazy. But with skin cycling, you basically just like rotate out your product each night so that you're not overusing them which I am definitely guilty of that so like one night you'll do an exfoliating night and then another night will be like a retinol night and tonight for me it is my retinol night so I really have been loving the good molecules gentle retinol cream I love this brand like in general they have really great products and they're affordable you can get them at uh, I was gonna say Target Ulta. And then I went in with the Hydrogel Cream from Honest Beauty. This is my favorite nighttime moisturizer because it's so thick and creamy. And then I used the Honest Beauty Calm and Renew Melting Eye Balm. This is also a little bit thicker, so it's perfect for nighttime. It's extremely hydrating, so I've really been enjoying this as well. And then, of course, my Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. I love this stuff. And this is the vanilla one, so that's what's on my lips. And the last step in my nighttime routine is always perfume because, yes, I am one of those people that likes to put on perfume before bed. It just makes me feel better, you know? And like, I love smelling good. And I've literally always done this ever since I was in high school. I always put body spray on or perfume before bed every single night. So I do want to give a big thank you to Sempered for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog. I am so grateful to be working with them today because I have loved Sempered for years. It is one of my favorite subscription services. So if you guys are new to Sempered, Sempered is a monthly fragrance subscription service where you can try out a new designer fragrance for just $17 a month and you get a 30 day supply, which is really cool 
because you don't have to commit to like a full-size bottle and spend a ton of money because you guys know how expensive perfumes can be but you're able to try out a new fragrance each month for right under twenty dollars they have hundreds of different fragrances to choose from lots of designer brands like gucci prada versace and they also have some more indie brands like vince camuto as well the packaging is my favorite you just twist it up and then you have your fragrance right here perfect for traveling or also if of course you're going to be on the go you can just pop it right in your purse which is what i always do these are always in my bag so these are the two fragrances that i have this one that i have here i discovered earlier this year and it's still in rotation because it smells so good it's the Catherine malandrino special moments perfume she has a lot of really good fragrances like all of her fragrances i feel like are very just like daytime appropriate they're citrusy and florally and like a little bit sweet but not too much and this one specifically i smell a little bit of like floral citrus but also a little bit of like berries but it does last a really long time on me and i always go for like sweet citrus floral kind of scents because i feel like they work the best with my ph and they last like i said a long time on my skin and this one is one of them i love it and then i also this is a new one and i always get compliments on this perfume this is the nanette lapore beauty abroad this smells like flowers and sweetness and citrus and like you just got out of the shower it's delicious i literally always get compliments whenever i wear this and i brought this with me when i went to new york with brie and she's like oh, what are you wearing and i told her it was this and she was like in love with the scent so it's a really good one i love both of these you guys can also discover new scents by taking the scentbird quiz which is actually how i discovered the catherine malandrino perfumes so it'll give you different options based on of course your quiz answers your personal preferences and your previous purchases so it's a really great way to try out our new scent so if you guys want to try out scentbird you can click the link down below in the description box and use my code jjvlogs55 to get 55 percent off your first month so that'll leave it at about just over seven dollars for your first month which is amazing so definitely check it out everything will be linked down below in the description box and thank you so much once again to semper for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog so bernard needs to go out before bed because i always like him to pee and like you know use the bathroom but when i call him and he doesn't come because he's like so tired this is what i do whipped cream gets him every time or i'll open up his cookie jar and he'll come up let's see if it works there he goes Bernard, right here, look. Yummy. <laughs> Works every time. I love when he puts his little ball on the plate. Snacks are secured. <laughs> Grapes for me, cereal for Hector. It's like such a weird combo. Now it's power time. And my, my colleagues, they tried everything. So this is me and Bernard's morning routine. First thing I do when I wake up though is always get him situated first. Okay, first he goes out potty. And I gotta check for the groundhogs. Hold on, B. We have groundhogs, they were in our shed, but then our neighbors also have them as well. So I always get nervous with Bernard. So I always do a little scope of the yard and check. Go ahead, B. <laughs> Look at him sniffing the groundhogs. He always does this. Oh, now he's ready for food. He's coming back. <laughs> so this is Bernard's breakfast. Sometimes I do switch it up, but he always gets, of course, his kibble. And I like to add some blueberries and strawberries. Sometimes I do blueberries with carrots or like something different. But today we're doing berries. I'm also going to add a little bit of this yogurt. He loves it. Cashew milk, unsweetened, plain yogurt. And then I also do a couple pumps of this. These are just his omegas. And then these are his little vitamins. I just add a couple of those for breakfast and dinner. And then I love these. These probiotics, these help him so much. So this is what I add also right on top. And then sometimes I like to do a little bit of coconut water. And this one's just pure coconut water. He loves his breakfast. All right, sit down. <laughs> Such a good boy, I love him. There you go. And then while he enjoys his breakfast, I'm gonna clean his water bowl out and put some fresh water in. And I'm just gonna do some coconut water in his water. He loves it. <laughs> and that is his little morning routine. It's not complete yet though until we go on his walk and then he gets his carrot and then it's official, but this is like the beginning of his morning routine. And you know he has to be a little dramatic <laughs> before I take him on his walk. And I've got to open up these blinds so we can get some sunlight. 
beautiful morning. Ooh, and we got some packages that we'll open up later. the bathroom because the lighting is just horrible without this ring light and i'm going to show you guys this new light that i got so good but anyways i just rinse my face with water in the morning i usually don't use cleanser unless i feel like i really have to but i usually just rinse with water i use cleanser at night and then just follow up with like my regular skincare so i'm debating if i want to work out today because usually if i work out in the morning i won't do my skincare routine until i'm done but i'm like do i want to work out and get it done or do i want to like get ready for the day and start filming then work out. I think that's what we're gonna do actually, just kidding. We're gonna work out later. So I'm gonna do a little vitamin C. This one is the Sunday Riley CEO vitamin C serum. I love this. I do about two pumps. It's super hydrating, this one also, I love it. And then I'm gonna do a little bit of moisturizer. This one is the Honest Beauty Hydro Gel Cream. I typically mostly use this at night, but today I feel like my skin needs a little extra moisture, so. I do this and then I follow up with SPF. Oh, and also I gotta do a little eye cream. But I love how hydrating this is, but like it's just so lightweight. Like it doesn't make my skin feel greasy. So you can use it under makeup and there's no fragrance to it, which I really like. So for eye cream, I love this one, the Good Molecules Eye Gel. And then I also really like this e.l.f. Game Up Resme Wakening Eye Cream. This is really nice and I like this also because has like this metal applicator. I'm gonna use this one today. So you can put it like right under your eyes. I got this from Target and like, it's really good. See the product just comes out and then with the applicator, you can apply it and it feels so cooling. I love metal applicator. And then I just follow up with some SPF. I love this one from Hawaiian Tropic. And I like to do a pretty generous amount of this and I also put it on my neck. You see how quickly it like absorbs into the skin? Love it. And then I do a little lip balm, and this is the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm. I've been loving this. I'm actually kind of running low on it. I use it like every single day, so love. And that is it. That is the little morning routine. And Hector just brought me up some tea, which is so sweet. This is homemade tea, ginger, apple, cinnamon. It's so good. It is a little strong though, so you definitely have to add some sweetener like honey, maple syrup, or agave. I love you, Bernard. I love you. You ready for your carrot now? Come on. Let's go get your little carrot. Morning routine is almost done for Bernard. Once he gets his carrot, he is ready to go. And there he goes. Also, I'm about to stock up our mini fridge that we have on our front porch. I shared this on my Instagram a few weeks back, but I got this idea from Casey Holmes and she posted it on her Instagram and it totally gave me inspo to get some snacks and drinks for our delivery drivers because of course I get packages honestly like every single day. We've been doing this for a little bit now. I want to say it's been like two months or so and it's been very successful. The delivery drivers of course always appreciate it. So this is our little setup mini fridge is from walmart and i got this sign from etsy and i just printed it out laminated it at staples perfect 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 now i can finally start getting ready to film so i always put all my jewelry on do my brows and kind of get all my products together first and this is like my everyday jewelry this necklace my name necklace is from shop baby gold and my little miranda fry cuff which i love these are little huggies also from miranda fry i love them i've had them for like two years and they're still like in great condition they don't tarnish or anything i really love miranda fry jewelry and then of course my engagement ring and then i have these little huggies that i got from amazon that i wear in like my second hole that i I will also link because I love them. They're tiny, but like they're still really pretty. And as I get ready for the day, I always love putting on my robe. And these silky robes are my favorite. They are from Amy Macedo's line called Beige. I have every single color. They are so soft, really great quality. I've had these for like over a year whenever she launched and I love them. So I'm always wearing these whenever I'm like filming content or if I'm just getting ready for the day. So I'm gonna wear the black one today. All right, I'm about to do my eyebrows, but I'm gonna be testing out 
the new house lab stuff i picked up a couple goodies last week from sephora and i didn't know that this was in sephora so when i saw it i was like immediately yes i purchased like pretty much everything from her line so i'm gonna be doing a full face so yeah super excited about that but i'm gonna just do my brows first because i didn't get her brow pencil because i have just my go-to brow products and i feel like every time i try out expensive brow products like i never repurchase them because i just love like my affordable stuff so i'm gonna just touch up my hair i'm just gonna pretty much straighten the bottom half for a little bit but hmm, yeah like i'm gonna just touch up some of these pieces back over here but oh, i love it i just feel like myself with my dark hair like this is me okay i also wanted to shout out this new light that i got it's from elios i will link it down below i am really really happy with this purchase it was pricier but it's really good quality and i've tried a ton of different ring lights and different lighting systems like this but this one is perfect if you are filming reels or tiktoks so i got the one with the stand in it but what i love about this is that it's not just a light it's actually a mirror as well this is it right here i like just got it recently so i still have the plastic on it but you just basically you can like put it in and use it as a mirror and like with the light on and i'll show you how bright this thing gets it's crazy so you have a couple different settings on here so you can make it brighter you can also change like the color of the light so this one is a little bit more of like a blend of warm and cool this one is more warm and then that is the cool tone lighting and then you can make it super bright and then you can also dim it as well and then this also comes with this piece for your phone which is really nice because it just pops right out and you can insert it different ways if you want to like hold your phone this way or this way you know but you can put this thing up to the side here and then just pop the mirror in and just like that i can't do it with one hand but just to show you the mirror is here and then there's another side to it as well which is nice but yeah my favorite feature about this is being able to film content so i'm really excited to film more like more makeup videos that's really why i wanted to get this and then this also does twist off of the stand and then you can always put it on this stand right here and like use the mirror this way as well if you don't want like the tripod with it so absolutely love this light i purchased it myself but i just figured i would mention it because i am so happy with this purchase so the video was a huge success you guys i don't know how it turned out but i'm really happy with the products that i tested out so lady gaga's makeup line is definitely like top tier like i'm so impressed and i've also been wearing this lip color for over two hours and i already ate something i was drinking juice water and this has not budged like it's crazy. Anyways, I wanted to open up some packages and that big box that I had earlier was actually my office chair and I got it from Amazon and I love it. I really wanted one that was like pink with some gold legs and I found this one. I find everything on Amazon, honestly, but actually it was really hard for me to find a chair like this, but I love it. I will link it down below. I have a little section on my storefront with like my office furniture, but these are the rest of the packages that I got. So I figured we could unbox them here together. First thing that we have is from Dose of Colors. This is so pretty this is the shayla x dose of colors i actually just saw this on instagram yesterday so this is like a little like wedding collab which i'm really excited about actually i want to do like a bridal makeup oh i want to do like a bridal makeup tutorial very soon with like my favorite products drugstore high-end for like wedding makeup oh this is cute okay so we get an eyeshadow palette a blush and glow face palette and then a lip trio we got to open these up the packaging is so beautiful very like wedding vibes yes so these are the lip products we have a liquid lipstick lip liner and a lip gloss dose of colors make some of the best liquid lipsticks like ever and these just look so stunning that's pretty it's like a pretty like rose pink and then the gloss this one is in glass slipper and it's like a sheer gloss with like gold glitter in it and then we also have the lip liner Ooh, it's a darker lip liner i love that that is going to be really beautiful together and then we have the blush and glow face palette i have to open everything up i'm like too i'm too excited not to and look at these huge scissors i also got these from amazon because i'm trying to like get all of my office supplies to be like gold and like white and i did not expect these to be this big but i love them pretty blush and then we have this it's a highlighter but for me this would be more of like a little topper you could also use this as an eyeshadow as well stunning wow that blush is really bright but it's so pretty and then the eyeshadow palette this is like i already saw this on instagram and i'm like yeah that's me in a palette look at these colors this is truly like the perfect bridal 
palette. You have some mattes, some shimmers, a nice black color. So congrats to Shayla. This collab looks so beautiful. And thank you to Dose of Colors for sending this over. The next package is from It Cosmetics. Ooh, okay. So we have a new, well, actually this is not new. They've had this for a while because I've definitely used this before. The Confidence in a Cream Transforming Moisturizing Cream. Oh, that's cool. It actually says it's supercharged with two times more anti-aging armor. I'm here for it. And then we have the Confidence in an Eye Cream. I don't think I've ever tried this before, but I actually really like a cosmetic skincare. Like I've tried their moisturizers. I tried this before and I really like it. So I'm probably gonna use this tonight, honestly, because I remember this being super hydrating. So thank you so much, A Cosmetics. Next package is from Milk Makeup. I think I know what this is. We have the new concealer from Milk. Oh, I gotta do a testing new makeup. So this is the new High Tech High Cover Future Fluid All Over Cream Concealer. Sent over three shades, which is really nice. This packaging is adorable. I love it. So I actually already bought this concealer guys. I went to Sephora last week and it's funny because whenever I bought it like the next day they DM'd me and told me that this was coming. So thank you so much Milk Makeup. I don't know if these shades are going to match. I don't even know if the shade I got is going to match, but thank you so much. And then we have the little prism makeup sponge as well. It's so cute. Last package that we have here is from Heritage. And this is an affordable hair care brand that you can find at Walmart. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Look at this big bag. There's goodies in here. I like this for traveling. It's a good size. There's a ton of little like hair accessories in here. Have this huge like hair tie. A little headband. Every time I see headbands, it reminds me of Blair Waldorf in Gossip Girl. I love these like claw clips. These are really good. They always like keep my hair in place too. What is this? Oh my God, these are shoes. These are Nikes. These are so cute. They're like pink and gray too. I feel like very fitting with the vibe of the brand. I don't think these are gonna fit because they're seven and a half and I am like the lowest I can go in size is eight. But like that is so sweet. Thank you so much for this package. And I have some other packages here. I already opened these, but I figured I would show because they are new products. So these are from Milani. They are the liquid contour and liquid highlighters. And then what else do you have? under eye brighteners. Milani, actually, I just went to Walmart like two days ago and they have a bunch of new makeup. So I'm gonna be doing like a dedicated Milani video with all of their new stuff. So that's probably coming next week, but these look so good. So thank you so much for sending these over. I am so excited. I love, obviously, love Milani. And I cannot believe that it's been almost a year since I collabed with them. Like so crazy, but thank you. I'm so excited for those. We also have a little package here from Tower 28. So this is the new Tower 28 Make Waves Mascara. And it is clean, vegan, and safe for sensitive eyes. And then I already opened this up as well, but I'm gonna be testing this new concealer out. This is from Too Faced, and it is the Ethereal Light Concealer. So they sent over two shades. So thank you again to all these brands for sending over these goodies. I am really excited about these new products. That is everything for today's vlog. I really hope you guys enjoyed enjoyed it. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. And thank you once again to Semper for sponsoring today's vlog. I will have the link down below so you guys can check it out. And that is it. I love you guys and I'll see you very soon in my next one. Bye!